Welcome to Math Challengers. In this video, we will discuss the following topics. 1. Place value and value of a digit of a given decimal numbers. 2. Reads and writes decimal numbers. 3. Round off decimal numbers. Decimals are numbers written with a dot after the unit's digit. The dot is referred to as the decimal point. The value of a digit of a decimal is equal to the digit multiplied by the place value it occupies. Let's have an example. In 5,342 and 6,789 ten thousands. The digit 5 is located in the thousands place. Its place value is thousands. To find the value of 5, it is multiplied by 1,000. Therefore its value is 5,000. The digit 3 is located in the hundreds place. Its place value is hundreds. To find the value of 3, 100 times 3 equals 300. 4 is in the tens place. Its place value is tens. To find the value of 4, just multiply 4 times 10 which is 40. The place value of 2 is 1 so to get the value of 2, just multiply 1 times 2 which is 2. The digit 6 is located on the right side of the decimal point. And its place value is tenths. To get its value, just multiply e6 times one tenth. So its value is six tenths. Seven is in the hundredth place. So its value is seven times one hundredth, which is seven hundred. Eight is in the thousandths place. Its place value is thousandths. To find its value multiply 0 0.001 times eight. We'll give you eight thousandths, or 0 0.008. The place value of nine is 10 thousandths. So its value is nine ten thousandths. That is nine times 10 thousandths, or 0 0.0009. Let us now have reading decimal numbers. To read decimal numbers, read the whole number part as normal. Use AND to represent the decimal point. And continue reading the number as normal. But say the last place value. 45 and 4 tenths. 19 and 56 hundredths. 689 thousandths 578 ten thousandths 109 and 3 ten thousandths 5008 ten thousandths If there are no whole numbers in the left side of the decimal point, you do not use the word AND. Rather, you read the number as normal. And end with the last place value of the number. Here is how we read and write this number in words. 5,421 ten thousandths 765 thousandths 765 Rounding off decimal numbers Example Round 19 and 186 thousandths to the nearest hundredths Step 1. Find the place you are rounding to. In this example we need to round off to the nearest hundredths, so underline the digit in the hundredths place. Step 2. Identify the digit to its right. If 5 or more, add 1 to the place you are rounding to. If it is less than 5 just copy the digit to be rounded off. The digit on the right side of the digit to be round to is 6, which is greater than 5. Then we need to add 1 to the digit that we need to round to. Step 3. 
drop all the digits to the right of the place you are rounding to. So to get the answer, 1 plus 8 equals 9. Then bring down 1. Decimal point. 9. And 1. So the answer of 19 and 186 thousandths rounded to the nearest hundredths is 19 and 19 hundredths. Example 2. Round 2 and 765 ten thousandths to the nearest tenths. Step 1. Find the place you are rounding to. In this example we need to round off to the nearest tenths. So underline the digit in the tenths place. Step 2. Identify the digit to its right. If 5 were more, round up by adding 1 to the place you are rounding to. If it is less than 5, round down. Just copy the digit to be rounded off. In this example, 7 is on the right of the digit to be rounded off. So we need to round up by adding 1 to 0. Step 3. Drop all the digits to the right of the place you are rounding to. To get the answer, just add 1 plus 0 equals 1. And bring down the decimal point. And 2. So we have the answer of 2 and 765 rounded to the nearest tenths. As 2 and 1 tenth. Example 3. Round 13 and 2345 ten thousandths to the nearest hundredths. Step 1. Find the place you are rounding to. Step 2. Identify the digit to its right. Since it is 4 which is below 5, then we are going to round down. To do that, just copy the digit to be rounded off. Step 3. Drop all the digits to the right of the place you are rounding to. Just copy 3. Bring down 2. Decimal point. 3 and 1. So the answer of 13 and 2345 ten thousandths. Rounded to the nearest hundredths. Is 13 and 23 hundredths. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe.